hello, hello, everybody. Welcome back to Hermit Crab. I'm stuck on a block. <laughs> this is Tango. Welcome back to Hermit Hills. And today we're going to be doing some building, guys, because last episode, you remember, we did this. Yeah, we, we put four hoppers on the ground in a chest. <laughs> no, we have a long, long, long ender pearl delivery system here to Hermit Hill. Hermit, yes, Hermit Hills. I always say the wrong one. Uh, to Hermit Hills, and we need something a little bit better than this, because that's not acceptable. So, we're going to be building, like, a little, a little shop. Creeper just got me here a second ago. <laughs> we're going to be building a shop here. I, I don't even know why I'm calling it a shop, because ain't nothing for sale. I'm just going to be, you know, obviously they're free for all the hermits to come take. But I'm going to, you know, put it up like it's a big store kind of thing. And I've got a building kind of planned out here, and I think you guys are going to like it. I don't do many buildy episodes, but this one should be one of the better ones. I'm real excited. We're going to have a big multi-store building here. Uh, very, very wood-themed, you know, very, very rustic, I guess you could say. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be a little shop for the Ender Pearls and the iron blocks that I'm going to be sending through the system. So, uh, instead of doing all of it, you know, talky-talky, chatty-chatty slow, which puts half you guys to sleep... We're going to bust on through with a time lapse and get started and get the bulk of it done. And then I will finish off the end of it on camera. So here we go. Yes, 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 yes. I like it. I am pleased. I am very pleased with how this is turning out, but we are not done yet by any stretch of the imagination. Quite the contrary, I believe we are just getting started because now it's time to put on the detail, all the detail work that's going to make this thing from just okay looking to kicking. It's going to be, yeah, we're going to, we're definitely going to knock this up a notch or two here. Uh, and that's just with all the little details we're going to add here. I got a lot of little things planned out I want to add to this thing. So the first, the first one I want to do is add some greeneries, some bushes. You can see, obviously, I kind of left some some spaces empty here. And uh, over here in the back, I kind of intended to. So yeah, I, I already know where this stuff is going. So what I want to do is just kind of fill this in. I've got a variety of, a one may say, a plethora <laughs> of bushes and shrubbery type things. Here at all this grass. We're going to bring grass back later, but it's a little bit hard to work with right now. So I want to get like you there. We'll say you there. And we'll say you there. And maybe one there popping out. Oh, I need to get... Uh, I didn't get shears. Oh, well, hopefully I have enough here. I just want a little bit here. Now, you can see right here I got, like, this opening here. That's going to be a problem, but I'm going to fix that when we deal with the stairs in just a little bit. Uh, and then over here, uh, we'll need another one popping out here. We'll go another, another spruce guy right there. It's starting to work. It's starting to work. 
All right, so now up here, yeah, okay. I want to do. I think I think the spruce is the is the best because it's not too bright, but I do want to mix it up. Get one of uh, you in there and another one up there. All right, that's working. And then this is a spot I was kind of struggling with. I wasn't sure because I want to put I want to put bushes like up in the sides and everything. I think I actually have to break that right there. I think it needs to be done. That's fine. That's fine. It looks a little weird with the with the block broken, but it's like all over. I don't know. Maybe if I put another one, if I put another one right there, it'll help. Yeah. And I can actually get like some lighting. I'm gonna make a pass when we're done here and put some pumpkins and stuff. And I can I can definitely hide one back in there now. And now what I'm gonna do is I got so many things I wanna do here. <laughs> so much more to do on this place. Uh, string and vines. Now vines are gonna be big because they look good on wood here. I think so. I wanna get them kind of. Kind of crawling down a little bit, but we're going to string and let's see. We'll let that one come all the way down. I got enough. Sure, why not? Do some vines there. Let's get another one up here and then we'll string way up there. Okay, good. And then I want to put like, get one like right on the wall here coming down too. Or on the, on the support beam or whatever. And then that'll grow. That'll grow over time. I'm not sure. I don't want to go too crazy with the vines, but... This stuff is really going to make a difference and make this place feel old and kind of worked in, that sort of thing. Uh, let's see, anything else in this general area? Do I need more bushes here, maybe? Do I need another one? We can go with another one there, maybe. Let's get the uh, let's get the other type, though. This guy. Yeah, there we go. A little variety. Mixes it all up. Okay. Let's see. Up here, first of all, i got to get some lighting in here because bad guys be, be spawning in here. Uh, all right, now over here, ooh, I gotta go get the stuff. I wanted to add a little bit, a little bit more life up there. So we're gonna go. Uh, I'll probably need these. I should hold on to those guys. You, 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 and we're gonna go flower pots. Give me some flowers and some of that and some of that. All right. I want to add like so we got the little balcony up here, but there's not not really any purpose to it or anything. Oh, I forgot to add a window there. Do I have my glass? This needs to be. That needs to be a window. That was a mistake. Uh, all right, so. We're gonna add like little little wooden pedestal things and 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 some benches and a little flower pot on each one. Papa Papa Poppy. Papa Papa Poppy. <laughs> and one of these guys maybe. Let's see how that works. Oh, those don't even fit in there. Shows what I know about flowers. How about a a peone? No, I'm being mocked. Are you kidding me? Er. All right, well, I got to get another flower. <laughs> I, I don't know anything about flowers. Uh, all right, we got to get another flower there, and I'll get the glass replaced there. Lighting is going to be a key issue here. I got to get I got to get everything lit up. I was kind of careful, though, like right... Oh, here I am making a liar myself. So this is all spawnable right here, so I do need to make this be... Hmm, I want to just do something like that for now, I guess. That keeps it spawn-proof. That's good. And then this is... Okay, that's on the half slab, so that can't be spawned. All right. Uh, all right, so yeah, I do know I went like spruce woods here and then oak everywhere else. I wanted the entrance to be a little bit more drawn out or more like, I don't know, just I wanted to stand out more. So I'm liking that. I'm liking the green there. I wonder. Yeah, OK. Vines need to be creeping and crawling up onto the ceiling, too. There maybe. Let's see. We'll see how that grows right there. I don't want it to get too carried away here, though. Let those grow a little bit. We got bushes here. Now we got the road over here, okay? So I'm gonna have to continue this road all up over here. It's gonna, I mean, I was obviously planning out where this is gonna go. The road's gonna come all the way around here and hook up to the road over here. Obviously different road styles, so I'll have to do a little bit of transition work there, but not too worried about that, not too worried about that. All right, we got some lovely uh, white flowers of some kind of name, I don't know. And I got the glass back in there for the window over there. So the next thing I want to do is really kind of mash up this stonework a little bit, because obviously it's all very pristine and perfect here, and uh, we can't have that. So I want to beat up all these stairs here, the outlying area here. Uh, oh, that reminds me, we need, we need a little bit of area here, too. Uh, shovel, shovel. Do a little bit of noise around here and make this like a little patio kind of thing is what I want. So let's see. I got to get... Da, 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 da. Oh, I got it right there. We're going to throw some mossy in various locations here. And basically just add a whole bunch of like noise everywhere. Uh, some of that, some of that. 
Add some cracked. I got all the varieties here. I need to add something to there, though. I'll add another mossy there and a crack there. No, come on, stop doing that. <laughs> we'll do maybe even a gravel in the back there. And then... Ah, I keep forgetting to... I don't want to break the bushes because I don't have... There we go. We'll just get some regular ones. Everything's not completely broken here. And then one of these guys. And we'll say... A cracked. All right, that does that a little bit. And I need a little bit of noise here and there, but I'll, I'll get to that in a second. I'll make a final pass here. Now over here, again, I want to kind of just rough things up a bit and do the whole noise thing. Put in some some of this wherever I can. Let's see, that, that, that. Add one here. Just in all the little, all the random bits. Make everything all nice and happy. But I got to be careful because I can't, you can't do it on the half slabs here. The only thing I can do on the, on the half slab is a little cobble slab action. It's pretty much the only variety I can think of. So I'll do that a little bit kind of randomly here and there like that. And then let me get another one of these guys up here. I'm liking this. This is going to make a big difference. And then up here again, let's see. Those are, those are on the half. No, those are the fulls. Okay. So I can do, we can do some of that and maybe get a cracked in there too. You get the idea. All this stuff everywhere here. Everywhere. Give me a cracked there. Cracked there, maybe. I like it. Now, these are all half slabs, so I can't really put full blocks underneath there because there are no half slabs for, you know, cracked and uh, the, the mossy. Mossy. Uh, all right. Need some more cobble in here. Like so and like so. Give me that and that. And that's starting to feel feel like the way I want it to. So give me another crack there. That's decent. That's decent. What about down here? What about down here? Yeah, I'll do I'll do a little bit more. I don't want to bore you guys to death. I just want to show you the general ideas of what I want to try and accomplish here. I feel like something is missing right here, but I don't know what yet there though. So that's the stonework. Now what I want to do is head over a yonder because the sides here are obviously kind of bland. So I need to do, well, I'm going to keep that up there, but down here, we're really going to grow this in. Uh, first and foremost, the, oh, did I forget it? Where are they? Where's my mossy cobble? I know I made some. I know I made some. There it is. That's probably not enough, though. We're going to start sprinkling this in in random places, like so. Put one there, one there. Problem is, is the green is just too green on this. It's almost like overpowering. And we'll throw one there. And then we're going back to bushes here. Where's the spruce? I like this I like the spruce the most. So we're gonna go up to there and then throw some birch over here, maybe. Something like that. That works. And then I'm gonna get all bone meal and everything in this area. I'm also gonna come back in here and put pumpkins under these too. So we can kind of get some like hidden lighting here without torches. But I kind of like that. And then maybe even, yeah, maybe even throw like a vine or two. Vines will be growing down. That's going to add a lot more character to this. But... Fell. <laughs> up, 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 up. All right, it's going to add a lot more character. So I'm going to do that right there to all the sides. Like back here, back here, and back here. So you guys are probably wondering. <laughs> I kind of glossed over it. This is obviously like the, the intake for the pearls which I need to take those out. Uh, obviously, that's not going to work outside the building. So I got to do a little bit of work down below before or later in this episode. We'll do that. And it's going to actually come up and go in here. So right in this little jut out or whatever you want to call it, extension to the building, that's where the intake and the storage is going to be for the pearls and the iron blocks. And then inside there, which we'll all go, we'll worry about the inside in a little bit. Um, but I just want to finish the outside up first. So I'm going to do that, the stonework to all the outsides and we'll move on. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. It is starting to come together, starting to feel a little bit more natural now. I might have went a little crazy on the bushes, but I really wanted it to feel like it was overgrown and like kind of, you know, just it, nature is having its way with this house that, along the bottom here. Uh, the next thing I want to do now, you can see I already kind of roughed in this here a little bit, the, the mossy and the crack everywhere. I, I'll be honest, I'm not sure what I want to do with this little underhang here. I, I decided I wanted like a little kind of a uh, rugged or stony, almost like almost like this little like masonry stone area or a little blacksmith or something. I don't know uh, uh, underneath the porch up top there. But 
To be honest, I'm not sure what to do down here. So I think what I'm going to do is... First of all, I'm going to take some of these out. Oh. <laughs> I see you. <laughs> out of my house. And we're going to do some slabs like that. And some more there and there. To just kind of give it a little bit of more structure there. And then I think what I'm going to do here, honestly... And this is going to be kind of weird here. I don't even know if this is going to make sense is kind of just go with like a like a rubble kind of thing like there's like piles of rocks here and stuff and we'll throw some of these put some like walls in the corners or something here just to kind of give it that unnatural like stuff has been piled up here i need some regular cobble if you guys have ideas for what to do with this area though i'm definitely I'm definitely listening i'm not quite sure I, I mean that goes with the with the whole the whole shop you know Overall, if you guys have any ideas of what to do with it, by by all means, just uh, just drop me a comment. I'm I'm listening, so we'll do that there. And yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave it like that. Maybe one more there. Just a pile of debris and stuff, kind of neglected, not really serving any purpose here, but could have a, a a use in the in the future. Now, what I want to do here, I didn't even talk about this really. The this is actually gonna be two different. I don't want to say shops, but up here, the main one here, this is going to be where they, the hermits come to get their pearls and their iron. That's going to be the one that's going to be all fancy and stuff. And then down here is going to be all really rough and tough and not really developed yet. And actually, I want to get... Where is it? I need a sign. And I want to kind of just close it off and make it clear that it's like, you know, condemned or... Oh, now I have to spell condemned. <laughs> Uh, condemned. We'll go with that. Uh, yeah, I say, I say we'll just do that. Well, what that makes it feel like, no, I don't like that. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna go reserved, I think. Because what I really want to do is I want to save this for a, a future, a future business or something like that. I, I may, I may do something down there. We'll see. Um, but yeah, up there is going to be the, the name of the, the business. And I don't know, I need names, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to go with something like, remote deliveries maybe I'm not sure but I feel like there's a clever name out there waiting for me um, so yeah if you guys obviously have interesting names for the the, the delivery or the, the shop I guess you could say that's gonna have the 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 pearls and the iron let me know uh, now okay now this is there's something cool here I want to add I want to add this is this really brings it all together I feel like up here do I have oh, of course I don't I need slabs. All right, let's put back some of all this rocky stuff and bushes. I need that, 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 and that's good. Right, right. Sounds good. We'll go this. All right. I'm going to add a little, like, shop sign up here. So a couple of slabs, like yoink, yoink, fence post right there. Come down one, and I'm going to go with a nice, big, bright... Kind of light, and I know this is going to stick out, and I know it's going to be ugly. Item frames, we're going to go there, there, and there. And did I get them? Okay, good. We're going to do pearl. We're going to do pearl. And we're going to do iron block right there. So I think that's going to look pretty good. Let's see. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> yeah, I like it. I mean, obviously that lantern kind of sticks out like a sore thumb, but hey, it's like a light at night. Looks kind of cool. Shows uh, shows what's going on here. All right. Now, the other thing, one of the other things, I got so many little doodads I want to do. I want your opinion on this, okay? So I've got, you know, you can see all the like logs poking out here and they're just kind of straight. So remember that, okay? Without, we'll say without the stairs. And now I want to do this and I'm leaning toward doing this I think I'm gonna do it but I definitely want your feedback on this guys if I should do some upside down stairs on like all of these going all the way around like so just do a couple samples here see what they so you guys can see what they look like whoa what <laughs> oh that's the that's the elevator oh yeah so Mumbo's sugarcane farm is like right under this I've got like three blocks to work with I mean, that thing goes all the way back there and everything, so I'm going to have to be a little bit careful with my uh, sorting system and everything as I bring it bring it up there. Uh, all right, so, yeah, paying attention to these stairs here now. What do you think? I kind of like it. It feels, like, a little bit more supportive, but at the same time, like, so without 
and with. I think I'm going to go with with, so let me throw those on now, but let me know what you guys think if you want to have uh, the stairs on all of them. And uh, yeah, we got a few more little bits and bobs here before we get into the inside. And I lied. There is, in fact, a distinct lack of bits and or associated bobs. <laughs> so we're going to head inside. The outside is done. And I'm not going to lie to you guys. Straight up, I love this place. This is I am super proud of what this is looking like right now. I think this is probably one of the coolest things I've built in a long time, if not ever. I don't know. I'm pretty pleased. I'm pretty pleased. I was happy with that guy when I built him. He's a totally different style, though, I think. But this guy is coming together. I really like it. So to the inside now. And what I want to do is first add some flooring in here. Okay. Because it's going to be a two-store kind of thing. So we're going to do like this. Pretty straightforward. I just want to get a little bit here so I can talk. Let me do a couple more. All right. So I'm going to add this floor all in here. And I think we're actually going to do is carpet it in here. I got some uh, gray wool carpet. But I'll be honest, I don't, I'm, <laughs> I'm really, really bad at interiors. So maybe the interior fairy <clears throat> will, will show up and uh, make this come to life and be magic. But I'm going to put a floor in here and get it carpeted. And we're going to start getting the actual elevator in place for the real items to come up and get the storage in and all that stuff. Alrighty, it is getting very late here right now, so I just went ahead and did all the redstone, and I am not proud of it. I'm not proud of it. It's pretty messy down there, pretty inefficient. Um, basically, I had designed this little tiny room with the intent of having two glass elevators come up, and that turned out to be just a nightmare down below. I was fighting having to sort the two one water stream into two separate water streams and it was just a mess. So I switched over to dropper elevators here. Uh, so they come all the way up here and then just dump into that uh, first hopper which goes down. So on this side we will have pearls and on this side we will have uh, iron blocks. So that's the plan up here and let me drop down here and show you the mess I created. So this, where is it? This right here is the water stream coming from all the way from the iron farm. Uh, so it goes in there into the little... Uh, the, the, the main problem I had here is... That. I am super close to Mumbo's uh, sugarcane farm. So I had to do some... Just some nonsense here because I couldn't go down anymore. So, yeah. Items come down here, go into this hopper here, up the little mini dropper vader here into this ugly hopper chain and then the this is the typical sorter here which is sorting out the iron blocks okay and then those iron blocks will then go into that dropper there and the pearls will go right across into this dropper right here okay and then we have two kind of synchronized uh, dropper elevators here. They're both going to click regardless of which items come in. So compared to reading both there and going to turn the clock around here, blah, blah, blah. And then basically the clock is going to turn that torch on and off, which fires the torch chain all over to the top. Blah, 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 blah. I know, I know. It's a mess back here, but whatever. This is all this, all this trouble is just to go through the, the fact of having uh, <laughs> to sort the items here. So I do want to give it one last try here. So let's do, we'll do like 10, 10 pearls and 10, ah, oh, I missed that jump like 7,000 times. 10 pearls and 10 iron blocks. So boom and boom. Now they're going to start going up the, uh, little elevator there, getting sorted through here. Yes, it's a noisy elevator. Don't really care right now because items are going to come through so, like, rarely. So we should be getting pearls accumulating there. Eight. Ten. And ten. Perfect. Okay. So it's working. That's the downstairs. So now I need to come up here. <laughs> Change the sign. Lisa Bailey. And come up top, top stairs here. And finish this off right here like this, I think. Because now I can do... Uh, get in there. Like this. Like so, like so. And then, yeah, I want to get... Oh, I don't have them. Of course I don't have them. 
Well, I'll just put I'll just put these in here for now because it's late and I need to end this episode. So it's gonna look like that, and then I'll have an item frame here and an item frame there, and then that's pretty much all I'm gonna do. I do have one thing left to say though, besides the obvious need for do I have carpet on me still? Uh, no. Uh, I do have one thing left to say. This spot up there is reserved for a certain somebody. <laughs> Somebody's going to be moving up top there, and he's going to have a new home in here. It seems fitting, I think. It seems fitting. But uh, it is now, looking up, it is now 2.34 a.m. I should probably get some sleep because i got to go to work tomorrow. <laughs> All right. This is going to do it. I, I spent most of my time on the outside of this place. Hey, hey, hey. Get, get out of my place. Get down with your chain mail. Did you drop it? No. Uh, did he drop it? Oh, see, that's how tired I am. I'm expecting him to drop chainmail. Uh, this is it, though, guys. This is it. I'm super happy with the outside. The inside is ugly. I might need to call some Isaiah action over to, to help me out there. But let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you think of the outside. Hope you like it. If you have any ideas to improve it, as always, I'm interested. If you have any ideas for the name of the business, uh, I am interested. Best I got right now is remote deliveries. But you may have a, a better one than I. And, uh... If you have ideas for what I can do down here eventually, maybe someone will take up my lease, maybe not. <laughs> but anyways, that's going to do it, guys. I got... <laughs> I need to get some sleep. I'll see you guys later. I'm out. <laughs>